<laughs> Hello there, my amazing gem and ring collectors. It's Morgan Strong Comic here. And I just wanted to do kind of a little smaller unboxing video with some blind bags and um, some creatives I support goodies. Uh, because I did a long video a couple days ago on St. Patrick's Day showing off all like my mall swag and my box lunch and uh, Hot Topic merch because I got stuff when I had <laughs> those discount codes to get every month and a half, which was fantastic. So yeah, just thought I would do that. Uh, showing my Shadow Pride. Shadow is my favorite character by far, although I love all the Sonic characters, from the Sonic the Hed Hedgehog franchise. In fact, actually, in my first book series, Spirit Vision, my paranormal mystery romance, uh, Umbra is kind of my interpretation of a humanoid version of Shadow. <laughs> so I like Shadow quite a bit, but I do have my Sonic necklace. Because although I love all the generations of Sonic, I think the GameCube, the Dreamcast GameCube version is my favorite of that generation. So I'm also wearing red because it's Hemophilia Awareness Month in March. So uh, in addition to lupus, which I do Lupus May, which is Lupus Awareness Month for purple and butterflies, I also do have Hemophilia Factor 11. So uh, I didn't want to wear that many days of red one. I don't own that many red shirts, <laughs> 30 shirts. Um, I do like red, but purple is my favorite color. That's why I have a lot of purple things. Uh, and two, again, I didn't want to do that twice a year. It's just kind of hectic. But I did want to bring awareness uh, to hemophilia, um, if, if any caliber, uh, and let people know who do have it that they do have support. Um, and there's ways to um, kind of just let yourself be known out there and help others. So hemophilia has 10 letters. So I'm doing 10 days of wearing red. This is my fourth day of the month. So I got to step it up <laughs> um, and get six in before the end of the month. Uh, Cause it's, um, uh, we're getting close, but I, I can do it. I can do it. So shadow is helping me. I have another red shadow shirt. So he'll be helping me 20% of this month. So thank you shadow for being edgy and awesome. <laughs> So there's that. I'm also doing a Kickstarter uh, for my new adult, which is 17 plus college age series about sarcastic monster hunting called The Hunter and the Bringer. Uh, book two is going to be narrated by the same narrators who did The Hunter and the Bringer, the first book. And that was a successful Kickstarter. My first one last year. Yay! So it'll become an audio book. Monsters and Mortals is over 500 pages. So about three times the length of the first one. So obviously we need more money. I've been working really hard extra hours at school to help save up for it. Um, the initial cost, narrators got to do their job. I respect that. Uh, but we still need like 47% of the funds, which is what the Kickstarter is for. It will start April 4th, I believe around 8.30 or 9, probably 8.30 uh, <laughs> um, Central Time, uh, U.S. Central Time. But it'll go on for 30 days and let's see there's lots of prizes uh lots of great packages uh just the page itself is full of cool stuff like chapter one is finished you're going to get an almost 20 minute sample of chapter one which is really awesome by lexi and logan we did that in december live on discord so that was really exciting um information about them and like i said lots of cool quirks quirks and perks and prizes um reviews about the team uh the page the page is a lot of fun I, we worked really hard on making it appealing for everybody so yeah hopefully we can get that funded and there'll be lots of information on my youtube on my facebook on my instagram um so be checking that out <laughs> all right let's get to um our little items though real quick so the first thing is i support cherry yuki who is my book cover artist for both spirit vision and the hunter and the bringer she's fabulous she has a wonderful patreon Patreon also. You can join my Patreon, uh, Morgan S. Komnick. Uh, the, the funds for that actually have been paying for the audiobooks for Spirit Vision. Uh, the third one's coming out at the end of the year. So, fun little segue. But she's, uh, what I have for Chiriyuki or Susie Zhang is she has a monthly um, tier where you get a print and two stickers and I'm on her highest tier, of course. I think it's either eight or ten dollars in the US because she's from Australia. I think it's eight or ten dollars, I don't remember a month, which is not bad at all. And you get a little postcard size original print and two stickers uh for the her chubby mushroom girl dressed up as the character. 
And the past several months, she's in at least seven now, but I think she's going to keep continuing. She's doing fairy tale series. So I don't remember if I showed the Snow White one last time, but I will again just in case. And I just got the newest one like a couple days ago. So here's the Snow White one. It's gorgeous. I absolutely love it. I like it's kind of darker with the, hey, matches your shadow. <laughs> um, but it is a postcard. And there's her mushroom girl mascot. And then you get two of the stickers. I guess one for you and one for a friend. A mushroom girl dressed up as the princess, which is super kawaii. So there's Snow White from last month. And then this month is Cinderella. Beautiful. She's holding the glass slipper. I like that it has the butterflies from the live action. There's the back. They're good sturdy material. And then here is the sticker. And I like that the rabbit has a little pumpkin coach. He's so cute. And then I got an extra sticker randomly this month because sometimes she throws in little extra freebies every once in a while. So I got almost like mochi little cats, cat animals. Very cute. So you can join Cherry Yuki's Patreon and get these uh, for 8 or $10 a month and support her. And you also get like um, their store discounts. There's uh, works in progress uh, where you get to see her actually make the creations and stuff. Um, and you, get phone, you can get phone and tablet backgrounds for free as well. So it's definitely worth it. I also have a friend. Uh, she's a children's author locally around here. And every couple months, she sends me a free postcard talking about her latest work. So it's Jessica Matthews um, and illustrated by Jennifer okay, uh, Stolitz. Stolitz? Stolitzer? Stolitzer. Um, and the newest one is this little leprechaun. So this is super cute. So it's the lazy leprechaun. <laughs> she has lots of fun, beautiful things. Um, it's available on her website, jennifermatthewsbooks.com or wherever books are sold and she gives like these postcards every two or three months about like a new character with a new character she's drawn a new book coming out on uh, updates on signings and stuff and I just got this and I was like you know I'm gonna, I'm gonna share her stuff so I only bought her first book a couple years ago but she's very sweet and I love the postcards I love how she does that so and I was free to join to sign up for her postcards so <laughs> Um, and last time I talked about a manga with Bam that I was, like, looking forward to that there's only, like, 10 or 12 series I've ever, like, well, I guess if I put all the clamp together, that's kind of cheating. But <laughs> there's only, like, a handful of series that, yes, all manga I want to read and get to the next volume, but there's some of them, like, I have to get it now. I have to get it, like, the second it drops. And this was one of them. It's called Orange. It's a very fantastic, it's a kind of dark, dark and light at the same time slice of life, but it's got a little bit of a mis it is a mystery but it was a little bit of a weird sci-fi twist but it works and it's really strange how it works um but I love it so I thought it ended a couple years ago the way they it, they ended it brilliantly the anime is one of the rare animes that follows the manga almost exactly to the letter they only added one little scene to the anime like a little five minute scene which actually made it even just a little more better, but it's almost like 100% follows the manga perfectly. That never happens or rarely happens. But then they announced, yeah, we got this, uh, the final volume. It's coming out in English in March. And I'm like, say what now? <laughs> so when we went to Books A Million, I grabbed it and I was like, I'm going to like inhale this like I did the other three volumes and I just haven't had time. Um, I do, I have her the first two chapters. So I'm going to do that today or tomorrow because I'm making my weekend the relax. So here's the final volume of Orange. And it's called Orange because like orange juice, which I can't have because I'm allergic. Life is a little bit sweet and a little bit tart. They do explain it in the book. So it's not like about oranges. <laughs> but and I, oh, the covers, letters are important. So I do like that they have that. So yay. Can't wait to read that. I also bought these at Box Lunch. I forgot I had them. Uh, they're mochi cookies with cocoa chips. So um, I, I, don't, I do like certain mochi, uh, but they're only $5. And there's a couple in there. They're all individually wrapped. And I like cocoa. So I was like, you know what? I'll... And I had Box Lunch money. So basically, if I spent, like, let's say I spent $30, I'd get $15 off as long as I had 15 discount. So And I had 30 So I'd just spend 60 to say 30 that kind of deal. But I was like, you know what? Let's, uh... Let's try it. So I'll probably, I have a, excuse me, I think it's Thursday night. I think it's Thursday night. It's either Wednesday or Thursday night. 
Um, I have my, every three months I'm going to do a Q&A for all my patrons, um, no matter what tier you're in. And I think I'll try one on that live. So, a little fun thing to do. I miss, I miss doing food videos. It's been over a year, but, you know, I can't. I'm trying to save money for other things. <laughs> all right, so now it's time for the unboxings. All right. So, I've got two of these Avatar. I separated them, though, because I have a secret theory about my luck with these guys um there's the ones I have four of the four of the six I do have two though so I'm separating them for a reason and then these just came out the Inuyasha I have two of the six I got two Morokus which one I gave to a friend for her birthday and the other one I kept of course and then Kagome so I need Inuyasha, Shishomaru, Shippo, and Kilala these are a little bit bigger ones they're good quality nice and round got two of those um, and then I got, so I'm collecting series six of the bad clips, which is the same. It's season two, season R, which is romance for Sailor Moon. Um, I have all but one of the four, I think they're the Sinister Sisters. Uh, but then there's, uh, four generals and I haven't had any of luck with those, but these have all four of the generals and Chubiu and Sailor Moon, which I already have those. But they're magnets for them. So I'm like, does not matter if it's a bad clipper or a magnet? I'm going to hang it somewhere in my house. But I'm like, I don't think so. So I just went ahead and ordered three of those. <laughs> Since I had box lunch money. And then the new set. I have tons of princess bad clips. I don't need any more. Well, I got more. Because these have the princesses holding a beautiful dessert from their home countries with cute poses the main reason i really wanted it is because aurora's in her peasant outfit which i don't have in any uh, capacity in a bad clip or a magnet and there's two mystery ones i didn't know so you can collect 11 total i got five though <laughs> all right so i think i'm gonna go with the inuyasha pins first because i can literally just like do that i don't know my luck ratio on these <laughs> so we'll see blue the teal blue oh yay shippo so i'm halfway there <laughs> yay awesome because so these are 10 they're like this is average slash a little pricey the avatars are nine these are these are nine and i think the magnets magnets are like seven the bag clips i think are probably eight or nine though <gasps> and shashomaru Ooh, Julie's man. All right, I did good. So I just need Inuyasha and Kilala. <laughs> I love it. All right, awesome sauce. So knock on wood. And I ordered both of those online. I have a theory about online versus in person, but again, I keep it. Well, unless it's Oron and you're Sarah. Long story. <laughs> Oron. Oron, blind bags, and Sarah have no luck. But she did get on the Harry Potter. All right, so let's try the Sailor Moon since I do have, I have the bad clip versions of Sailor Moon, Chubiusa, and then three of the four Sinister Sisters, but I don't have any of the generals they advertised here. I know there's only three generals on the package, but there's a mystery one, and I know it's the last general because I can tell from the shape. <laughs> so it just makes sense. Oh, I guess I should try the pop trick. I haven't done that in a while. I mean, I'm getting spoiled with skizzers. Pop it, lock it, poke it. God, it actually is not really. Maybe that's fun. <laughs> Never mind. I got a bandit on my finger. I don't know why I'm singing the hoe down, throw down. Yay, I got one of the generals. All right. There he is. I've been all frowny, frowny. I don't know if I want bad guys on my fridge, but I guess I'm going to have bad guys on my fridge because they were there. <laughs> they were cheaper. Okay, so he's the second in command. Okay, and I got Sailor Moon, which I already have in the bag clip form. So I'll probably sell or give one to a friend, which I figured that would happen. You know, it, it, it's, possible. it's possible. Okay, so Saphir. This is Saphir. I can't remember his name. It's blank. Remember the other two? Mercury and Shibuya. Oh, well, I got one general. <laughs> and two bees, huh? 
which I already had an extra of her, so I'll definitely be uh, giving her, selling her to somebody. All right. Well, I got Saphir. So he's going on my fridge. Awesome. Okay, now these, I don't have any, so we'll uh, look at the draw with the princesses with the desserts. Do they have, like, a special name? No, they don't. <laughs> series 44. Disney Bag Series 44. Holy guacamole. All right, I'm not listening to <gasps> Belle with the curl stones. And she, I love that she's in her peasant blue outfit as well. Oh, I like it. I like it. That's a big croissant. <laughs> That's a huge croissant. Oh, my goodness. Okay. Are you going to do the pop trick? I don't know with my bandage, but we can try. Nope. <laughs> I think I tried the other way. Oh, oh, almost had it. Nope. I think these are getting thicker, too. Which is, usually things get cheaper. Can I say except you're welcome? I got Moana on there. Okay, now look at, now look at, look at. <gasps> the homegirl Jasper! Yes! Yes. I, I always have to, she's my favorite. And hers is called, Confesh? Confesh? It looks like a quiche. She's like kind of Arabia, Moroccan. She's in Morocco at Epcot. Which my teacher friends are talking about. They're like, Epcot's boring. And I'm like, unless you want to get, you know, tipsy. And I'm like, okay, yes, you can get tipsy at Epcot. And they have the best festivals. But I they thought the World Showcases were boring. And I was like, are you kidding me? If I ever go back, I'm spending a full day at the, and getting everything I missed. Because I have a list of things I missed. Because Epcot was crazy i loved it i absolutely loved it oh Pocahontas. i love that the, she's sitting in this it's beautiful she has maize maize cake corn cake oh i love it thanks girl you're awesome <laughs> okay so i want them all so i'm not going to be like okay i have to have this one not one I'm doing pretty good. Oh, this one's already ripped. Hmm, conspiracy. <gasps> Cinderella, and she's from France. I love this. I did like the sass. Cinderella's like not my favorite favorite princess, but I like the sass. It looks like they're chips, but they're not chips. Souffle, the souffle. Because she's from France. Again, love the sass girl. Oh my gosh, I cannot pick up this little tiny baby piece. All right, last one. Last of the princesses. Almost said it like from the Madeline movie. I love the Madeline movie. I need to watch that again. The animated one. Oh, I love I love the live action too. Another Pocahontas, which is nice. And I know what for. I'm gonna get that one too. Or give them to it as a present. Oh, hey, hey I, four out of the five were new. So not bad by any means. I'm going to keep this just so I can recollect which ones I need. So I didn't get any of the mystery. Which I bet one's Tiana. And the other one has to be Snow White. So Snow White probably has apple pie or some kind of pie. And Tiana's probably has beignets. But I think Tiana is in her frog gown. Just from the, I don't know. There's, look at the two mystery and tell me what you think. So I need Ariel, Aurora. I did really want Aurora. Uh, Moana, Mulan, Rapunzel, and the two mysteries. So I need seven more. <sighs> but that is a good start. So good start. So I am fine with that. All right, last one, Avatar. So here's online. Here's the store. Okay, we're doing online first. I'm not telling my theory because I don't want to chase myself. Okay, and I only need two more. <sighs> I don't know why I'm nervous now. <laughs> I just am. Oh, blew my theory. Okay, Momo. So my theory is, well, actually, let's open, let's open the last one and then we'll see. And then we'll see. Okay, last one. Last one. Okay, nothing is Momo though. Here's the one I got at the store so I could get the discounted backpack, which was in my other longer video. 
Oh, 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 turtle duck. I mean, do I have a turtle duck? I don't think I do. No, maybe I do. I no, I think I do. Dang it. I think it's the otter ping one I need. Yeah, okay. But I still love the turtle duck. And Momo. They're very cute. Okay, so my theory was until recently, I would only buy, so this is the fifth time I've bought one of these and online. So I only would buy one at a time and I got a different one every time until now. So I got Naga, the polar bear dog. I got the turtle duck. I got Appa, Aang Sky Bison, and I got Momo, the flying lemur monkey. I need the otter penguin. And I need my favorite, Bolin's best buddy, Pabu, 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 the fire ferret. So he's the one I really want, but I also want the otter penguin. So, oh man, that was so close. Uh, okay, well, that's all right. That's all right. We're all, we're all friends here. <laughs> it's okay. All right. But okay, not too shabby, not too shabby. Okay, friends. Well, that's my quick little unboxing of blind bags video. I did get some new friends. I got all the princesses. Well, I got four of the princesses. I got Belle, Jasmine, Pocahontas, and Cinderella baking their sweets. I got Shishomaru and Shippo from the Inuyasha. And I got Saphir from the villain line of the Sailor Moon Season 2. So awesome sauce. And I got some things to sell or donate. <laughs> All right. Uh, you guys have a wonderful, wonderful day, wonderful week, wonderful life. Uh, know you are awesome. And get on out there. All right. You are in control of your chaos. If Shadow can roller skate with that, then you can too. Because always that's why he has skates on his shoes. I'm like, why not have skates on your shoes? <laughs> All right, guys. See you next time. Have a good one. Bye.